Officials at the Nashville Zoo say this was the busiest day at Grassmere since the pandemic started. Now the beautiful weather may have been partially responsible, but as News Channel 5's Chris Davis discovered, a special event at the Veterinarian Center was the biggest draw. Hi guys, how are you? It's a flurry of activity inside the Nashville Zoo's operating room. I fixed a lot of the fur babies around here today. Concerned owners watching as the ones they love. Does she trip and fall? Go under the knife. Oh, I see it. It's a paw injury. That happens a lot. I can fix that. Only to be stuffed back up with love. So normally I shave my patients. <laughs> I don't have fur in the way. On normal days, this space is used for an arc worth of zoo animals. You ready? Oh, this is a good patient. This is what I'm used to right here. This is... But on this day, it's flushed full of plush. I've sutured up everything from lions to bears to flamingos. Oh, and Tigger and Donald. <laughs> Dr. Heather Schwartz plays the role of surgeon for both the real animals and their stuffed companions. It's a place where they can come and actually get them doctored and repaired because they fall apart too or have injuries. I love the stories of why they're injured are super great. I had a monkey that danced too much. Thankfully, not all patients are in critical condition. Three-year-old Finn's T-Rex is in need of a little shine service. Hey, teeth are not clean. His teeth are not clean? Okay. While others can fit in a quick physical. Take like two or three pounds. There's no doubt the cuteness overload is the main draw but the real purpose of this clinic is educational. We saw it when it was being constructed, but this is our first time in it. It's a rare chance for parents and kids to actually get inside this veterinary center to see how it works. I just really like that we can inspire them to look at careers. There you go. See all the different jobs that are offered in zoos and with animals and hopefully inspire them to care about animals in the future. And if the real animals get just a fraction of the love shown in this operating room. I bet you if you hold Daisy's paw, she'd be a little less nervous and I bet her heart would slow down. <gasps> it is. You can be sure they're in good hands. The photojournalist Devin Crawford, Chris Davis, News Channel 5. That's so cute, Chris. Thank you. The Teddy Bear Clinic continues tomorrow at the Nashville Zoo. The event is $5 to attend and you do have to pre-register.